Hi, you can now generate content for your Tilda website easier and faster using artificial intelligence. AI text generation comes in handy when the website copy isn't ready, but you need a draft or when the client hasn't provided all the text, such as service descriptions. You can also use the AI assistant to generate text for selected fields if you only need to correct a part of the copy to make the text look more appealing on the website. There are different ways you can generate content. Using the text editor toolbar at the top of the page, the content panel of the block, or generate text for the entire block using the quick actions panel. Let's see how to do this. To access the text generation window for the field, go to the page editor, select the block, and click on the desired text. In the text editor toolbar on top of the page, click the star icon, generate with AI. In step one, you'll find a description detailing how the text generation works, a link to the guide on using the AI assistant in Tilda's help center, and the terms of use. When generating content for the first time, review these terms and check the box to accept it. In step two, you will be asked to specify the area of your business and add a brief description and some facts. This will help you generate a better result. Below, you will find examples you can use for your website description. You can enter a pre-made example by clicking the apply button and replace it with another one by clicking use example. Suppose I want to generate website copy for a public speaking school. I will enter my description. Click Next to proceed to the prompt window. This step is optional. Here you can refine your prompt by adding details or keywords. Say you want to generate a description for your public speaking school and highlight that you hold summer camps in the UK every year. You can clarify your prompt. Add that we hold summer camps in the UK every year. Similarly to the previous step, you can preview and choose examples of other prompts below. Click Generate. Here's the result we've got. The generated text can be edited within the field. For example, you can remove certain words or sentences. You can copy the result if, for instance, you want to translate it into another language. You can also regenerate it if the text doesn't suit you at all. If you notice an error, please notify us by clicking on Complain about the result. To do this, select one of the categories or add your comment. To have the generated text added to the block, check the box to confirm your responsibility for the generated text and click Apply. Text generation for the field in the content panel works similarly. Click Content, select the desired field, and select Generate with AI in the toolbar. This will open the same text generation window. Now, let's see how to generate content for the entire block at once. Let me choose a block from the Features category. Next, I go to the Content panel of the block and click the Generate Content with AI icon. As you can see, I am already on Step 3 because the website description I specified previously has been saved. If you want to change it, you can do it by going back to Step 2. Step 3 here has new settings for your prompt. Firstly, you need to select the number of items in your block. This setting only applies to blocks with item-based structure. These include blocks from categories such as Features, Tile and Link, Team, Reviews, How It Works, and others. By default, the number of items is set the same as in the block example. You can increase or decrease this number if needed. The second setting, Only Filled Fields, is available for all blocks. With this setting enabled, text is generated only for fields that are already filled in. For example, if you remove the subheading field from the block because you didn't need it, the subheading text will be skipped during generation, saving you the time of deleting it again. I have prepared a query for this block following the principle I described earlier. Let's specify the advantages, then click the Generate button and see what we've got. The advantages I listed are now mentioned in the block items, with descriptions added for them. The generated text is immediately updated in the block. All I need to do now is to click the Apply button to save the changes. Additionally, you can regenerate the text by clicking the Back to Prompt button or call off the generation by clicking Cancel. Let's click Apply. Done. We've covered how to generate text for both individual fields and entire blocks. For detailed instructions on working with the AI Assistant and other Tilda tools, check out the Help Center. The link is in the description. Good luck with your content generation. Bye.